What's up, what's up? It's your man, Jimmy Chan. A student receives a test scores of 62, 83, and 91. Student's term project scores an 88. Okay, so let's go ahead and put these down. So test is 62, 83, and 91. Wow, these are awful. Me, my writing, that is, not the grades. 83 and 91. All right, the student's term project, so project, is 88. And her homework score was a 76. So it says that each test is worth 20%. So this exam here is worth 20%. 20% and 20%. The term project is 25%. So this term project is 25%. And the final grade uh, of the final grade and the homework grade is 15%. Okay. So that is how they grade it. It's all weighted. So number one, you have to make sure that these decimals here actually add up to give you one, meaning 100%. Okay, and it does. So with that being said, perfect. So now what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to multiply these here. All right, so let's see. So we have 62 times 0.2, which is going to give me a 12.4. 83 times 0.2 is going to give me a 16.6. 91 times 0.2 is going to give me an 18.2. 88 times 0.25 is going to give me a 22. And 76 times a 0.15 is going to give me an 11.4. So what I want to do is, because that these are all partial of my total grade, then I'm going to add these together to find out what my averages in the class. So I'm going to take 12.4, um, add it to 16.6, and add it to 18.2, and add it to 22, and add it to 11.4. And my average comes out to be at 80. Oopsies. 80. Point six, And there we go. I hope that helps. If there's any questions, let me know. Okay. If there's any questions, let me know. See ya.